you guys on today's video, I'm going to be updating your Mac. So let's get started. On the top left hand corner of your screen, you're going to see the Apple logo. Just tap on it. And your second option will say it's system settings. Now, before we go into there, I want to show you that also before we used to do all our updates under the App Store, but that's no longer a thing. And just in case you have not set up Time Machine, I would set that up right now before you do anything, just in case. So I do have a separate video that teaches you about Time Machine, but make it back up right now if you already have it set up. So back up right now. Time Machine is already something that's pre-installed on all Macs. You just need to set it up with an external hard drive. Anyways, we're going to go right into system settings. In system settings, we're going to see this popping up. And from here, let's say you don't see anything for some strange reason. You can always go into search, go into software update. This will come up. If nothing is loading for you, just turn off and on automatic updates and that should refresh so you get the latest update, which is this one right here. If you click on more information, it's going to tell you exactly what you need to know about this particular update. It's nothing that special, but it's always good to do these updates just in case. Anyways, we're going to click on install now. Now remember to close any other apps that you have open. So my background I had Safari opened, I just closed it just so it doesn't get in the way. Make sure you're not working on any projects or anything like that when you're running any updates. It's only a gig, so they should be quite fast. But even with that, just make sure to have at least 30 minutes of your time so you can give to this, just in case it takes a little bit longer than what it should. So right now, we're just going to click on Install Now. We're going to see this. Just click on Agree. And then from here, it's going to download the update. So right now, we can see it's downloading. After download, you can just leave your Mac at this point, technically, because it's just going to restart by itself. It's going to have a little countdown on the side. And then you're going to see an Apple logo loading bar, restart, and you're all done with the update. It's that easy. So no, you don't need to be in front of your computer for every second that it's downloading or installing the update. So as mentioned, if you left your Mac alone, it would have just restarted by itself. You would have seen an Apple logo, a loading bar, and then you're back here. It's just going to all restart by itself. You can always double check software update, see if you're up to date. And there you go. Also, if you don't see this right away, you can always go into the search area and just type in update. From there, you're going to see software update and it's going to take you here again. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.